Okay, let's say your screen isn't working, or you want to upgrade it with a touchscreen, or in my case, smash to bits, let's replace it. Parts People Tutorials. Upgrade or repair your Dell. Need the part? Find it here. If you're having issues with your LCD not displaying correctly, there's a variety of reasons why this may happen. The first thing that I do in this situation is to connect to an external display. This will help me determine whether or not my issue is actually the LCD screen or possibly the GPU or display cable. Okay, the first thing that I recommend you have is a Phillips head number zero screwdriver, a Torx head number five screwdriver, as well as a plastic scribe. So if you need these or a Dell replacement part, I'll leave links for them down below. To begin, you'll remove the bottom base cover screws. Don't forget about the hidden screw located underneath the XPS badge door. Then use a plastic scribe to separate and remove the bottom base cover. Remember to always disconnect your battery before doing any repairs on your laptop. Now unscrew and remove the LCD cable bracket and then disconnect the LCD cable. Okay, removing this battery screw right here will allow you to pull the LCD cable out without having to fully remove the battery. Now disconnect the other side of the LCD cable. Alright, a quick sidebar, if you're still having trouble finding your issue, or if you're feeling overwhelmed by the whole process, you can always reach out to us because we can diagnose and repair it for you. Links to find out more about repairs are in the description below. Unscrew and remove the antenna cable bracket, then disconnect and remove the Wi-Fi card. Then disconnect the remaining LCD cable. Unscrew and unfold the LCD screen from the palm rest to separate them. The reassembly of your laptop is as easy as following your steps in reverse. If you still need to purchase your replacement part, click here to visit our site and find it. And while over there you can view our printable instructions that include images to help you along the way. And also don't forget we have more playlists here so keep checking back. I do read your comments, so leave any questions you have for me down below. Thanks for watching.